This server is crazy full. Does that girl have a baby? Lexi Maya. 17 and she's a mom? Oh my goodness. <laughs> Who's this girl? I deserve two spots because I'm so rich and gorgeous. Um, excuse me. Maybe I want to park there. Here, I'm going to park right here. <laughs> this girl's crazy. She's going to try to get two spots. There we go. I just took one of her spots. Okay, maybe three. You do not deserve three spots. You're lying. What? What is this? It's my parking spot. What is this? A rust bucket? Do I should make fun of my car. Hey, don't make fun of my car. How dare you even breathe the same air as me? This girl is so mean. This car is literally hanging by a thread. Leave my car alone. It's probably faster than yours. It was a present from my dad. My car is literally a V100. Your car is slow as heck, I bet. Your dad? What? A dumpster man? <laughs> it's a job, man. A job is a job. Are you not ashamed of yourself? Are you not embarrassed? Stop hating on poor people. She's like, you would know. <laughs> This girl is literally so mean. Wait, so is this girl like rich or something? I feel like she is, dude, because she's kind of spoiled. So I said, like, uh, are you rich? My pink Jeep can gap your rust bucket. <laughs> dude, why is she being so mean about it? Okay, well, uh, how do you get money then? By being me. Whatever. At least I work for my money. So I appreciate things more. You spoiled brat. Wait, she said, toodles, talk to me and breathe the same air as me when you're on my level. Whatever, dude. I bet if I dress up rich, maybe she'll treat me a little bit different. But that girl girl's so mean, dude. All because, like, I don't have a cool car like her. It doesn't matter what you drive, man. <laughs> but, okay, this one looks nice. Let's put on some... Okay, there we go. <gasps> Look, oh, it has a Supreme tag on it. It has a Supreme tag, so you know it's expensive. Oh, she's here. She said, LOL. What? Why are you laughing? I'm rich now. Not you shopping at Goodwill. What's wrong with shopping at Goodwill? All the cool kids be shopping there now. Uh, I said, Look at my pants. They have Supreme on them. That means they're expensive. You got no drip. Why is she even following me to the store? Supreme is for the poor. Aw, <laughs> uh, you look so cute sitting there doing absolutely f***ing nothing i got tons of drip here let's see if we can find a better shirt oh this one's pretty cool it has like flames on it and stuff it's all about dior <laughs> oh my gosh you're basically dry my grandma got more drip <laughs> Your grandma doesn't have more drip than me and she's dead. Oh my gosh. I said, girl, shut up. You know nothing about high-end fashion. She said six feet under. <laughs> she said, leave my hand out of this deuces, poor boy. What the heck, dude? She is so mean. Uh, whatever. At least she left. Uh, so this is the inside of my house, you guys. It's not much, but it's home, man. So I'm very, very happy with it. Maybe we can get a job. Look at me, bro. This is fun. Like, I'm genuinely enjoying this. Cutting the grass to my brand new house, my cool car up front <laughs> look at this dude it, it, it actually gets louder if you zoom in more uh oh it was at this moment that he knew he up. here comes trouble what do you want she said ew what <laughs> why are you following me you're lying to me is this true what is she talking about what is what true of course this is where you live what what's wrong with it <laughs> what's wrong with living here no i can't this is too funny what's funny literally i don't get it like no other house would make sense this is perfectly for you is it because it's a little trailer park house little rundown house there's nothing wrong with living in a trailer park you guys fun fact in real life like i'm not even joking i literally grew up in a trailer park and actually not just fine she said i can't <laughs> Stop following me. I don't want to play with mean people. You are spoiled. You are just too funny. Boo hoo. <laughs> Can I ban her? Is she even on my property? Oh, I did ban her. <laughs> Grow a backbone, baby. <laughs> I just don't want to get bullied, man. She's just leaving. Did she really just hit my car? That was not necessary. That was so not necessary. <laughs> right to jail. Right away. She's so toxic, man. Where did she go? Okay, look. Her car's all the way down there. Let's follow her, bro. I mean, she has to live in a mansion, right? If she's so rich. She loves to make fun of the poor, but is she, like, really rich? Does she live, like, in a huge mansion? Or let's see. Let's find out. Oh, my gosh. It's not. It's the freaking crack house. There's no way, bro. What is that? What the heck is this? There's no way this is your house. I thought you were rich. This is like the ugliest house in Brookhaven. What are you doing here? What are you doing here? Is this your house? Um, no, it's my maids. Then why does it say your name out front? I thought you were like rich. She said, please don't tell anyone. Wait, so you're seriously poor? Like for real? <laughs>
<laughs> no one at school can find out, but you were talking all that smack, though. Oh, why? I know you're a good person. I trust you. Why were you making fun of me, then? If you're poorer than me, explain yourself. It's my insecurity. <laughs> it doesn't mean you can just bully people. Here, I feel bad. I can hire you if you want. Seriously? Yeah, do you want a job? I can pay you money. Um, okay, this is perfect. Yeah. Meet me at my house. What job? Uh, let's just say cleaning services. Uh, what do you say? She's like, okay. Mm, cool. Uh, hurry up, maid. Where are you? Two thousand years later. Jeez, what took you so long? Oh my gosh. Oh, I still have her banned. Oh my gosh. Unban me. You're late, missy. Sorry, I crashed a couple of cars. Oh my gosh. Welcome to your job. She's like, all right, give me money. No, you're supposed to work for it first. Have you like ever had a job before? You're supposed to work and then I pay you. She said, um, no. <laughs> what? That's what a job is. Okay, what do I do? I learn. Okay, so first you can start mopping, then cut the grass in in the backyard. Well, come on, start mopping. You're my maid, you're supposed to do work. She's just like, cool. Is she ever gonna do work? She's just standing there. Don't rush me, okay. Why is she being so mean to me? She's the maid. Let's see if I can uh, drop uh, some food or something. Maybe that'll get her mad. Oops, she said, watch out, idiot. Wait, pick that up, I dropped it. Wait a dang minute. <laughs> What, what are you talking about? This ain't me. This is humiliating. You haven't even been on the job for two minutes. Wait, why do you think I got a gun? Put the gun away. No, she's shooting me. No. Oh. What's wrong? Oh, she's trying to blow up my safe. No, my money. No. She said, you just got hustled. Oh my gosh. Are you kidding me, bro? Why would she say that? Where is she going now? Look, she just crashed. Give me my money back. Hey, come back here. I'm not done with you. <laughs> Give me my money back. Stop. Dude, she's such a bad driver. Look, it got stuck. <laughs> it got stuck. <laughs> Oh my gosh, it's on fire. Are you kidding me? Help, help. <laughs> the car is on fire. Oh my God. I'll take you to the hospital. Don't worry. Even though you were kind of mean to me, I'll still take you to the hospital. Stay with me. Don't go into the light. Here you are. There you go. How do you feel? You feeling a little bit better? Thank you so much. No problem. Oh, she says she apologizes. Wait, are you really? Is it like a real apology? I accept your apology. You guys, she was really mean, but I mean, hey, you know, she apologized. I don't deserve you. <laughs> Here, come on. I feel bad, dude. She's actually really poor. Here, what if we, like, buy her a house or something? You shouldn't lie about being rich, okay? There's nothing wrong with being poor. Just be yourself. Don't try to be something that you're not. You're so right. Oh, look at that. Lesson learned. Here, I'll give her, I'll give her, like, a small house. It's better than the one that she had. Even if you're a cornball. <laughs> Why can't she just say one nice thing, bro? Look, this house is for you. Oh, this is so cute. It's for you. It's not the biggest, but it's a home, okay? Moral of the story is just to be grateful for what you got. Thanks so much. Hug me, brother. <laughs> what is this, Drake and Josh? <laughs> I'm not even your brother. I don't even know you. <laughs> Anyways, you guys, that's going to be a happy ending, man. Make sure to subscribe. I'll see you in the next one.